Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Worlds of Magic. It is time to continue our grand journey towards the conquest of the world and of the universe of the known universe, beginning with the fall of Wadefield, because we are here at Wadefield with a large army that should have absolutely no difficulties dealing with this mage. Although it's been a while since I fought the fought her, so and she does have a city wall, so take that for what you will. But I have to I have golems. And golems smish things. They smish them good. Alright, no area spells, which is too bad. This army used to actually have is this the army that used to have her with one of our uh No, this was a specially built army just to come in here and take her out, wasn't it? Oh you think so, do you? Golem, forward march. I guess we'll see how far I can get without actually uh, invoking my um, my own personal magic. Let's see, what do we have here? We have low-level spearmen and high-level spearmen. We'll just start softening everybody up a little. Actually, we should really start on these guys, shouldn't we? And start popping some clerics before they can use more mana to do things and cause trouble. Hey, use your shooting stars. Let's make these guys make them a, make them history. Nicely done. How about you guys make these clerics history? Oh, or they could make their saving throw. That would be annoying, but there we go. You make them history. Darn it! Two down. Ah, oh, hell. Let's ask them. Clerics on acid! There we go. Another saving throw. We'll find that. Oh, well, there we go. That dealt with that nicely. You coming out the gate? I've taken out half your ranged attackers. She obviously doesn't have much in the way of magic ability, because she's not even doing anything. All right, so you're going to make me come to your gate, are you? I think I'm going to have to do a wall disruption here. Where is it? Disrupt wall. Let's see, let's hit the gate. Make sure she can't close it back up again. All right, apparently it doesn't work on gates. Okay. We'll just keep moving diagonally towards the gate then. I mean, eh, we should be able to figure it out. Okay. Alright, let's begin. Starting with the archers, because they're annoying. You need to annoy me, boys. Time to go away. And last but not least... Really? Alright, well that was kind of a waste of three shooting stars, but ah well. Come on, get some hits in. One hit point. Hilarious. Fine. I'm gonna start firing randomly into the crowd here. And that should do that. Come on. Exit your city. There we go. That's what we want to see. Sort of. Kind of. In a really that's annoying sort of way. There we go. That's starting to look a little better. Excellent. And there's something we can seek, sink our teeth into. Let's uh, yeah, let's just do it this way. Put the golems into harm's way and get them to start uh, swinging at my golems. And we'll soften them up with our uh, ranged attackers here. You guys aren't going to do anything anymore. So 
All we have to do is make sure everybody is softened a little. And just let them walk into the walk them into the grinding uh, line here. And last set of archers. Whittle them all down. Perfect. And let's end the turn. Whoa! An actual spell. I didn't realize you could do that, lady. 88 hit points on those guys. Huh. Yeah, that's not doing you guys so well, is it? Definitely have to push the golems up a little closer if we can. Nice. Of course, my guys are hardly getting hurt at all by these wimps. Oh, interesting. You can stack one on top of the other, apparently. Okay. That is interesting that they can amalgamate stacks like that. Alright, let's start with golem number one. Give you an excuse to move diagonally. Come on. Let's, uh... Pop these guys a little. I'm trying to get my golems some room to move in to the uh, space here. So if we can smash these guys. Nice hit, hammer hands. Alright, we're going to try and bottleneck them a bit at the gate. Alright, hopefully that's just... that guy's already used all his actions. You know, I think we're just going to leave it exactly as it is. I think that's going to do. Make them walk to me a bit more. And turn. Bring it on, guys. Where are you going? Oh, you're going to attack my golem? Oh, I think he's going to hit you. What do you think about that plan? Attack my golem, he hits you in the face. Nice. Hammer hands, smash! Smash some more. Still alive. Not entirely helpful, but I guess we can just get him with a flank. Okay, let's see. Golem, smash. Okay. Golem number two. Move up to a more useful location. And ranged attackers start popping some spearmen. Nope, I guess we're hitting them with some hammers as well. No biggie. Her armies haven't done enough damage to really matter here. And one more hit should do the trick. In turn. One. And two. Hammer time. Oh, I miss. Annoying. Okay. Hmm. How irritating. I guess we could have just popped them. We should just be popping him with a uh, firebolt like that. And then we'll soften up these uh, swordsmen a little. Or possibly do them in completely if I have the right guys in the right place at the right time. Couple of good hits should do it. Well, I didn't work so well. That didn't work so well either. Wow. These guys are tough. 
Not a lot of hit points, but boy, they sure have damage reduction going on. Alright, well, I guess we turn and see what they do. They're going to attack my defenders and get smashed in the face. Excellent. And that will take care of that. Another city is definitely what we need. Destroyed the armory? That's about it. Alright, we got, should have everything we need to build what we need, or build the important stuff. So let's step out of here and get some uh, defense in place. What happened? Okay, hold on. Crossbowmen. Oh, we need the armory. Okay, well, I can afford an armory. Purchase that. Done. Get a minimum of two sets of cross... Get a couple in place. And then, since you got nothing to build, you can just start making trade goods after that's done. And you can reassign... these guys until it's one per turn. Sure, there we are. That'll work better. Excellent. The party continues. Next taker on the earth plane. Ooh, hell Ooh. A one-way gate from one of the planes of hell. It looks deadly. Hmm. Spell circle. Fire elemental demons and gargoyles. Those aren't actually even particularly dangerous enemies. And it's on our way. We might as well check it out. The growing army of... Yeah, something. There's my defensive army for there. And onwards. Oh, excellent. Was this an attack I was about to do? It was. It's got a mediocre attack for defense force. But it might be nice to take care of... This is his last city? Yes, it is. So it's going to be nice to take care of all this first. Just as a little bit of a cleanup project. As I can live with him existing for one more turn, so I'm not particularly fretted about that. Okay, well, the plane of uh, the overworld is almost mine, if you can believe that. Which means it'll probably be a good time to go and take on the plane of Watergate here shortly and see if there's anything useful down there. Come on, turn. And then... For death. And destruction. And otherwise amusing things. It's funny that I didn't even have to build boats on this plane because I could just uh, use the two separate portals. That's a lot of stuff just happened right there. Let's see, where do we want to start? We might as well start right here. Hey, guys. Oh, she got killed. That sucks. All right, well, unfortunately, there's not much I can do about that. I don't have any intention of reloading because I foolishly got her killed. She wasn't as effective a um, hero as I would have liked, to be perfectly frank. Okay. Okay. Onwards to the Underworld, and another Dwarven Defender. What are you building anyway, city? Hammerhands, Hammerhands, Rune Golem. Oh, okay, we've been building those. Could just quickly rush this into, uh, into play here. Worth contemplating. One, two... Sure, why not? Let's get this, let's get this party started. I'll get you going on Grave Wall and some trade goods. Because, heaven forbid, I need another. Now, where was I going to send you? You were going to go... Let's see. That's actually the part I hadn't figured out yet. It'd be nice to send... Actually, you should go to the Plane of Water, which means you need to go through this Prime Gate, which will put you right close to a Water Gate. Perfect. The plan is set, the die is cast, it's time to send them on their way. Be a few turns before they arrive, but that's okay. If I can get them to actually start walking in that direction. Yeah, five turns, okay. 
Oh, and speaking of armies on this plane. Okay, you're being fortified. You guys are heading for that army right there. Beautiful. Just keep wiping out her armies. Ooh. Nah. As I suspected, nothing bad happened. And that's all for that. Now I was going to go back to the Earth Plane and find that army that's supposed to be my main city defense force here. There we go. The city is defended once again. Okay. Now well, these guys, interestingly, are not putting up much of a fight. So I have an underworld army. Oh, what was that underworld army doing? They were were they fortified till healed? I can't even remember now. Guess we better find out, huh? No, there is only one way to find out. Gonna do anything, Romings? You're just gonna wander around being Romers. A whole lot of stuff going on right here. How are we doing on the spell of domination? Not a clue. Looks like it's gonna be a long time. Who are you? The army that's going to attack Southport! Which is going to involve me not allowing uh, the uh, auto-resolve to screw this up for me. So. That's a lot of clerics. You have a lot of magic on your side there, sir. Or lady. Madame. Guess we'll see how that stands up against an army of golems. I wonder how well an army of golems would even work. I think I'm going to use the actual healing ability of the War Priest this time. Tune up my golems a little. Yeah, they could use a couple of uh, little patch jobs. So I think their see, heal ability, I don't think we'll quite get three heals out of them. Okay, so I can't heal the golems. That sucks a little. You can heal other people, though. Your hammer hands. You know, most of these guys are not hurt enough to, to justify actually casting heal spells. So, back to the offensive work, guys. Take out those clerics. Take out your counterparts. Ha! Beautiful. Finish him. I said... Finish him! Ah, we're talking. Next up, shooting stars for cleric number two. Cleric saves. Alright. Can the clerics save themselves this turn? Well, if they live, actually quite conceivably because they're clerics, they can heal things. So we're going to have to put in a little suicidal thoughts on these guys, I think. Think sad thoughts. Think very sad thoughts. And... You guys keep moving in. You stay back, because you're actually pretty badly hurt. Silence. Is that what she cast? She cast silence on a non-caster unit? Not impressive if that's what she just did. Yeah, I think that guy's beating himself up. Which is not actually what I intended to do. I meant to bloodlet him, but... Too bad. You know, with how effective this Starbolt thing is, I'm surprised their clerics don't use it, because I had a cleric that had that ability, too. Hmm. That diagonal movement. Pretty funny. Does not get us very far very fast. Clerics, pop! Not dead yet, but will be very soon. Be dead! Play dead! Alright, fine. Arrows? There we go. All right, next bolt of shooting stars. Fire away. Not bad. Let's hit the other one that's at full strength just to 
whittle them down a little. Not adequately, but a little. Hmm. Well, they've used up all their mana anyway, so they're now glorified um, melee units of some sort. They're not even going to have an impact on the, on the game now. But you can start bleeding anyways. I think everybody's had their options. Now everybody's had their options. Oh, Archer still hasn't gone. Let's see what we can do with those. Excellent. Bleeding out. They're bleeding out. I don't get what she's trying to accomplish with silencing those guys. That's just weird. Hey, we got some new takers coming through the gates, ready to have some fun. Alright, let's diagonal you guys into position. Let them only take one offensive attack uh, hit on us this round. You are out of mana, you can retreat. You are out of mana, so you can retreat. You guys are also going to be out of mana, so you can also retreat. Because worst case, I can soften these guys up and then uh, basically make them... You know, there's no reason to attack those clerics right now. There's every reason to attack the guys who are outside the city walls and vulnerable. There we go. And you guys are wounded, so I'm going to just take you guys out of cert for now. You guys are going to stay back as support. And we're just going to drop a fire arrow on these guys right here. There we are. Keep bleeding out. Good. So what are you going to do now? You're going to walk into my trap. Poke my golems a little. Alright, well that's interesting. Not having a lot of luck with this so far. Welcome to the firing line. Where you will get softened up by archers and fire throwers before our golems pummel you into oblivion. And our hammer hands, because hammer hands are awesome. Wow, none of you managed to escape. That's interesting. Alright, that's that done. You guys move up by one. Soften up the full strength of army here. Actually, that might even pop them out of existence. Nope, not quite. Alright, they are below 50%. We'll hit those guys now. And then it's going to be up to our melee fighters. Hammerhand, smash! Wow, good job smashing. Golem smash! Guys smash! Golem smash! Golem smash! Golem smash! And done. I don't think I'm really needed at this point. Seizures! Okay, I guess those guys are out of commission. That's interesting. Interesting to see an effect like that actually work. Yeah, tactical movement in order would be nice for you guys. You're going to get some attacks next turn, so we should soften them up a little. You guys. And boom. Uh, and apparently we're smashing those guys. Oh, that didn't work out so badly at all. Hit him. Hit him again. Retreat. Retreat. Just for something to do. Retreat. Forward. And enter. Let's see where these guys are actually going to try to go. That's actually a very interesting question to me. Where are you going to go? 
into there. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Forward to smash. Those are hammer hands. Hit. They're good. And one more of those from you guys. Oh, wow. This is why this army will be resting up soon. Alright, Gollum, hit those guys. Hit him again, boy. Perfect. A perfect kill. And full strength guys are going to get the full brunt of the archers. And everything. You guys can move up now. And let's see what else we got. Those guys aren't a threat. Those guys are probably the biggest threat now. Turn. Seizures, you think so, huh? Smash. More smash. You're a little insane. Okay. Let's see. We need to soften these guys up because they're actually full strength. That'll do. Hammerhands should be able to handle it from here. Even with a little... being a little wounded. Okay, and range attackers, can you... Oh, you're out of mana. Apparently we're almost out of mana here. You know what? Fine. Fine. We'll just start you bleeding and see how that see how that goes. Oh, and you're gonna save, you jerks. Fine, bring it on. Apparently a save does not involve actually saving for some reason. Or it doesn't prevent the whole effect. Done and done. Take the city. Destroyed half the city, apparently. Okay, rejoin the army. Actually, no, we need to get you out of the city and then fortify until healed. Because Southport needs to rebuild itself. Everybody into construction, as it should be. Get a few more of those guys and then start rebuilding all the things that got destroyed. Armors, barracks, marketplace, shrine, stable. Trade goods. Done. Okay, you guys. Well, that's another city under my control in my expanding Empire of Doom, which is getting reasonably challenging to uh, take out. Could I take this as an auto-resolve? Definitely should not. This will be wipe out for another guy if all goes according to plan. We've got a catapult. Weird. Still makes me wish I had a uh, full destructive power. You know, a big AoE would just be gorgeous right now. So the catapults are going to be annoying, and the clerics... Eh, catapults are the most annoying thing right now. Because it's probably not going to move, and it's got lots of ammo that it's going to be using to drop rocks on the heads of my troops like I usually do to them. So we're definitely going to put those to good use. Shooting stars into the cart of doom. Actually, hold on. Has it got fire vulnerability? No, it's just a siege engine. Nothing fancy going on with siege engines. Just a thing that needs to explode. And one more hit should do the trick. Pop goes the catapult. Apparently not. Wow, we're just doing piddly damage to this, aren't we? There we are, that's that taken care of. Clerics, down you go. Maybe. 
Darn guys. Alright. Melee units forward. This army's got three hammer hands in it. And turn. I don't think I can use any of my mana right now. Ooh, a Sion Blast. She actually used a reasonable, powerful spell right there. Your blessings in place. And our uh, Annihilation targets are in place. I should move these guys over this way. Try and cluster my guys up a little more. Okay, over we go. Everybody get into position to face these guys head on and defend my uh, dudes a little. Clerics are not a major threat now that the uh, mana is gone from them. Much like my guys are not a threat after their mana is gone. Let's just see what we can do with some fire. Come on, pop. Darn clerics. I really don't want to use more uh, lightning bolts or energy bolts on them. Alright, I guess I'm using one more... Uh, Firebolt on them. With a few extra dice on it just to make sure it's done. Thank you. Alright, now shooting star, the guys in the front rank here. Clean it up. Get her done. Spread the wealth. Everybody can have some shooting stars for the face. I hope you enjoy it. Alright, Igor. Igor the Tyrant. You coming into position to be smished? Yes, you are. Excellent. Okay. Yeah, you just walk right up to my armies, and I'll start shooting with stuff. Okay. Starting with you, Diagonal, and... Smash. One down. Yeah, my guys are going to be all out of mana, so start retreating just to get you out of my way. This is just really just to get them out of the uh, party so that uh, they're one less thing to worry about, really. But these guys can keep partying as long as they've got mana left. Some of these guys full of arrows. A few close range shots for these guys. That'll make my uh, hammer hands a little bit better. Holy smokes, guys, that was a hell of a hit. Wow. Guess that's what happens when you've leveled a whole bunch. Hammer hand smash. Smash! Smash again! Good job. And turn. Frostbite! No! Not the frostbite! I don't know exactly where these guys think they're going, but they're letting me have the alpha strike every bloody time. Which I am just fine with. All right. Soften these up a little. Well, most of my guys got out of the way. Just a little, a little off the top. Got their hit points. That wasn't quite enough off the top. All right, forward march and smash. Forward smash! Wow, I'm surprised they didn't get uh, side attacked. That's interesting. They're still alive. Smash. And 
last but not least, the hammer hands need to move to there. And that's going to be... Yeah, nothing left. Please retreat. End the turn. He's fighting for his life, to be honest. I can't believe these guys aren't taking any swings at my troops at all. That's a little insane, if you think about it. 33 damage from one hit from these hammer hands. Everybody concentrate your fire on the guys who are getting out of reach. Let's see if we can get them actually toasted before I have to do something else with my hammer hands. Last but not least. There we are. Okay, one down. Two down. Another hit. Come on, guys. You can do better than that. Alright, the hammer hands are going to have to take over this. Now we're talking. And then two smashes from you. One smash. Two smash. And the finishing blow to you guys. Make her done. And turn. One more. Come on, guys. Walk into melee. Thank you. You are our most excellent assistance at dying. One down. Those guys took, actually, the settlers took a pretty good hit. And smash the evil spearmen. And Igor the Tyrant, with any luck, would be no more as of now. Goodbye, Igor. Take it. You are done, Igor the Tyrant. Goodbye. You've been dissipated. Congratulations. Alright, we'll deal with this city next turn. Where's this army in question here? Oh, hey, look, a water portal. Just what I was just thinking about looking at the water plane. Huh, you guys could probably do it. You guys still have not figured out how to walk to this place here. Okay. All right. Oh, defensive armies under construction. A city that has finished building everything but a merchant guild. Oh no, we've got a bunch of things to fix. No, this is the city that just got conquered, so we need... Uh, crossbowmen. And next turn we'll actually hurry one. Okay, onward. And then... That's all for today, guys. Hope you've enjoyed the episode. We have almost finished off another Sorcerer Lord. Oh, I better go look at that Underworld. I haven't seen an army from the Underworld in a while. Just got to do this before I forget. I know it's been a longer episode than average, but it's going to happen sometimes. It's got its values. Come on, Romans, will you just finish what you're doing so I can look at the Underworld and find out where my army is doing? I mean, seriously, come on. Come on, game. Relinquish the turn to me. Relinquish. Way too many roamings. They're obviously all just wandering around doing stuff. Minor problem. There we go. Shadow Plane. Oh, you guys were building a uh, siphon, weren't you? That's ex just exactly what you were doing right there. You were stealing a siphon. Apparently that city's under... Okay, nope, 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 nope. We'll pick this up again. Oh. Oh. He's spreading like a freaking weed. Apparently. Okay. Well. We can keep that from being efficient for him. Alright. 
now we're done. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Hope you've enjoyed. Bye for now.